All right, how's everybody doing? Um, it's kind of, it's not late at night, but it's like 8 p.m. It's winter, so it's a little dark out here. But um, what I'm doing right now is, uh, ever since I got my Mini, I had this uh, little battery flap. Uh, I don't know, whichever asshole that previously owned it, or I don't know if it was a mechanic or something, they decided to cut this part off here from this actual, uh, this plastic piece so I, I seen it before I bought it but I, I didn't mind it that much but I guess now I'm just getting around to fixing it I could buy a brand new piece but I mean I don't know how much that costs I didn't really even look into it a simple kind of solution I came up with is I just take this hinge here which I plastic did black I'm gonna take this hinge I'm just gonna attach it here and uh, so you know part of it's gonna attach to this uh, plastic part uh, that covers the uh, this kind of uh, engine bay this left on the passenger uh, passenger side of the engine bay and uh, I'm gonna attach the other part of the hinge to this uh, thing to this door flap for the battery just a cheap simple solution I I found the hinge just kind of in a toolbox. It wasn't being used, so I thought I might as well make some use out of it. So yeah, it's, uh, I already kind of tested it out with just putting some, uh, what do you call it, putting some duct tape on it and just making sure that, uh, you know, the hinge works okay. And it worked just fine for a low price fix yeah, I don't think it's gonna be too bad so it's just gonna as you can see I don't know what the heck they did they seem to have just kinda cut it with something and they really cut it pretty crappy too so I'm just gonna use these black uh, drywall screws and uh, go at it so yeah, just to make sure yeah it's pretty good. It doesn't show from the outside. Just uh, gonna put it right here, more or less in the middle. And uh, let's see how it goes. So I checked the back, there's nothing back there is just empty space so uh, it should be fine these are a bit long I think these are like a inch and a half or something but since there's nothing back there I don't mind even if it screws it up I'll just you know buy like a new or a used one off eBay or something not too worried about it. I just thought, you know, <laughs> let's try a cheap fix and see how it goes. The hinge was originally gold, so I decided to plastic dip it black. It just, uh, Oh. <laughs> All right, that's okay. They're kind of big. I guess I could always kind of dremel this off. I mean, it's not hurting anything. Yeah, they are long, but they're not, you know, they're not touching any lines. They're not touching the battery or anything like that. So yeah, there we go. Simple fix. So anyone, if anyone's had this kind of issue, you know, just find a hinge probably lying around or, a, uh, or even just go buy one at Home Depot, or Lowe's, or Rona, or wherever. And yeah, because mine was just kind of moving around all the time and like uh, every time I was opening my hood, it was just like in one place or another. I wasn't staying in place. So I'm like, let's try to figure something out. 
yeah there we go cheap easy fix cost me nothing especially since I had the screws in the uh, in the black plastic dip in the hinge all in all a cheap easy fix hope it helps people out there have a good night